I let's see. I believe our reshrinker should have worked. Yeah, so I fixed be... the shrink ray. As it turned out, when Steam updated, it decided to uh, respawn the one file that makes grounded crash horribly. I've also despawned Wide Slenderman, and um, uh, the, the guy has left. So um... yeah, should be back to being a drinking straw, right? Yeah, just just the drinking straw. I don't know where the guy came from. That the old old two three legs. That might have been Wendell, for all we know. We can't prove it wasn't him. That's just what Wendell does in his spare time. He pushes a giant cylinder that crushes yeah. all the world. He pushes a tube. He's a very simple guy. All right, everything a second to load in. Did just boot the game technically for the first time. Going to take my water now. with me. Yeah. Hello, Mr. Ant. I'll leave you be for now. All right. So I have some cleanup that I have to do in the pond because, like... Actually, first of all, I want to go rebuild the marker at the fallen oak branch. Because I've been putting that off for so long at this point. I know where the oak branch is now. I just gotta go fix the marker. Big plank that the wolf spider lives under. Is that the marker? Nope. Uh, but I know where the fallen oak branch is now. It's this thing right here. It seems a little mm. bit incongruous to just be here. And I was thinking, like, why is this just here? And then I realized it's because it's it's a fallen branch. I was being very silly. There's also a bunch of grubs over- oh, oh dear. A bunch of grubs over here it sounds like, which is interesting. Thankfully I don't actually need grub parts anymore, now that I have muscle sprouts. Hmm. Let's see. I like how Since we're technically beating sprouts, the crap so. out of the muscle sprouts with, um... The smoothie station in order to make them stop fighting back. Yeah, we're just using a blender. Oh, hello, there's mites on this log. There's so many mites on this. Why are there so many mites on this log? Wow. I guess we're technically by one of the lasers where the mites eat the electricity from. Or close ish to it, at least. That's fine, because the mite goo is actually really important for health potions, of all things. Hmm. The mighty smoothies are made with mite fuzz, after all. Get it? Uh, mighty. I understand. I get it. Yeah, I think they're literally just clay and mite fuzz. Uh, but also, I have a fact about Brussels sprouts, actually, since I since I have muscle sprouts and I'm I'm thinking about them. Mm -hmm. uh, if you liked Brussels sprouts, or if you disliked Brussels sprouts when you were younger, and you tried them again as an adult and you like them now, that might actually be because of genetic engineering. Um, they actually have been working on a less bitter cultivar of um. Brussels sprouts for a very long time. And so now most commercially available Brussels sprouts are actually a variety that have been purpose bred for many generations by scientists to make them less bitter. Hmm. And to just make them overall more palatable. And kids are really sensitive to bitterness, so that's why a lot of kids didn't like Brussels sprouts, and as adults they they do now. Debittering the Brussels sprouts. Also Whoa. I've finally fucking completed that one quest to make the oak marker log. And I know where Birdbath Bluff is as well, so I'm gonna head over there while I have the daylight on my side. Because that's actually over in the hedge. Wait, really? Yep, there's a birdbath right by the hedge. I did some research between uh, sessions just to kind of... Uh, you know, make everything smoother for myself because I've been I've been struggling for a long time. I 
And by struggling, I mostly just mean I've kind of lost a lot of larva over here. Excuse me, boys. I have no quarrel with you today. But I will strike you down with my rapier if you dare come after me. Please don't be a big spider that just aggroed on me. Okay, just a larva. That's fine. Hey, bud. Tiny. Yeah? Yeah. Tiny. I, I was saying the yeah to the larva because he had the audacity to attack me. <laughs> Oh, there's a lot of them over here. You're entering a bastard zone, I would think. Yeah. Which is fine, because I can just kinda... poke them to death. I mean, I guess mosquitoes would be pretty good at just, like, sucking the, the juice out of those boys. Alright, make sure I have enough clovers before I go up there. It'd really suck if I got all the way up there and just didn't have enough stuff to repair the... ...marker. So yeah, I have to get to that bird bath basically, by climbing part of the hedge. So now that I have the hedge lab unlocked, it should be a little easier, because I can just go up the, uh... The, like, hedge lab entrance that's, like, down below. Theoretically. Uh, Birch, thank you. Let's see what's sneaking around here. Spiders. It's it's spiders. Hoops. It's always been spiders, and it's always going to be spiders. Would you believe it that? It always has been, and always will be. Spiders is eternal. Imagine an eternity of spiders. That's what this hedge is. The web sacks, pop can. I'm trying to find. There was like a groundborn entrance, I think. Oh, hello, spiderlets. Don't worry about me, guys. Run away! Run away! As a mix. Ah, oh, they're still behind me. Okay. Fair enough, boys. Fair enough. They're not. I swore there was a little like lab entrance over here that looked out on the uh, sort of rest of the hedge. The. Ah, there it is. The back door. Cause I don't want to climb that gosh dang hedge again. What? Oh, does this the literally just lead door. over here? Dang. Oh, maybe I can go up this spiral staircase properly now. I won't get killed by a spider in the process. That's okay, buddy. Oh, there's a milk molar in here. Hmm. Well, you, you've you attracted my ire. I must obtain the milk molar, my friend. Milk molar. Acquire. Big orb weaver. Oh boy. Dang it! Alright, I'll have to get back over there. And by get back over there, I mean I'm gonna load my auto save. <laughs> Woof.
I don't like death running. It's not a thing I'm a fan of. I need to figure out a way to become even faster so that spiders just cannot approach me. Is there not, like, speed boost ultra ultra? I mean, I could make aphid shoes. That's one of the options I have. Yeah, but those aren't particularly defensive. Yeah, but I could just keep them, like, in my pocket to slip on when I need to run away from shit, I guess. My skedaddling shoes, you know? I get you. Hmm. I would make you less defensive, unless you were... Hmm. Unless it was like a, oh, I'm, I'm already in danger zone, I just need to leave, you know? Yeah. I just want to fucking sprint away. Get up to the top of that dang bird. Probably would help if I was actually wearing an armor helmet, but I think I left my actual armor helmet at the beach. Or uh, at base Thassalophobia, rather. Base, sometimes I cry when I think about the bottom of the ocean. What if you touched an isopod? That'd be terrifying. What if you perfectly envisioned... A sort of a beast that lived in the water, and it was bad. Yeah, it's the isopod. It's touching me with its little mouth thing. What if there was some sort of a, a of a water creature? All right. I might just try Most... and one v one this guy while there's no uh, orb we rejuvenate around. Get ready for bonkus. Square up, king. You've got such focus. The ability to stun. Ow! He's knocked me over! Bonk, bonk, bonk. There we go. I do like that when you lightly tap them, they collapse into a pile of parts. Yeah. Well, once the spider uh, gives up their sweet loot drops, they lose all bodily integrity. This is a fact that not many people know about spiders. Ah, uh, of course. Anyway, I'm gonna take off the badge that makes me way weaker to the fucking agent. Spiderling Juniors, because, uh, fun fact, that badge does make me weaker to poison. <laughs> What if I just poked you? What if you came at me and I just poked you, huh? What would you do? Yeah? Hit me. Yeah. I've got life steal, buddy. Life a lot steal. of bandages, which I will now slap onto my many wounds. All right, milk molar time, baby. Slurp that yolk. Yum yum. All right. I don't... Okay, I think I can ascend those mushrooms to get up into the hedge lab, and that will let me get up to where I need to get going. Maybe. No. Are they only going to let me down the mushrooms? Don't make me remake the hedge ascent. I'll cry. Oh, there Video we game go. says... Oh, nope. Nope, you're good. Hello. Oh, you pissed off. You pissed off the older brother. Oh, 
dear, there's a lot of them. We got oh. life steal though. Alright, big boy. Oh, another big boy, huh? Big boy might be trouble. Hang on. Poke him. There we go. Oh. Here I thought this was gonna be an easy excursion. Shows what the heck I know. You appear to have aggroed every single spider in the fucking lab. Hopefully you don't encounter any from this point forward. Yeah, we can hope, you know. You! Yeah, they, Bozo uh, was speaking too quickly. They, they breed like spiders in here, believe it or not. Who would have guessed? I think I can get where I need to go from on top of here. Maybe. I think that's the branch I need. Somewhere in my horror. Up this way. Branch that basically goes right to it. Yeah. The bird bath. Oh, there's a milk molar up here too. But this might not even lead to the bird bath. Well. Oh. There's a piece of laboratory zip tied up there. Okay. At least I'm making a nice profit of delicious multivitamins through all this work. Okay, so the branch to get up there is actually way farther that way. Let's see, I see. Bull is the bird. Oh, hey! Congratulations to the humans! They oh. finally discovered where the eels fuck. I thought the it eel. was the, the Sargassic Sea. The European eel, uh, specifically. Uh, uh, let's see. Also, uh, Broodmother Research Notes. Trial 24, Weevil, cooked, no interest. Trial 25, Ladybug, raw, some interest. Trial 26, Bombardier, raw, no interest. Trial 27, ah. Bombardier, cooked. The odor is horrific, yet it seemed to appeal with her. So, oh, the Brood Mother BLT, huh? Hmm. So I can summon whatever that thing is. I have you a know. feeling it might be what's making all of these other spiders. The, bi the, big, the big spider problem. Uh, anyway, um, the eel thing was only hypothesized uh, up until recently. We got, like, actual proof of it on video. Confirmation of eel sex? Yes, confirmation of eel wow. sex. Eels do, in fact, make... make sweet, sweet make music? Sweet, sweet music. Yes. <laughs> Playing that super sargassic saxophone? Catch me out in the oceans uh, playing saxophones over algae blooms. It attempts to make them go faster. I wonder if that would work. Plants do respond to noise sometimes. You know, if you scream at a plant hard enough, it'll die from the thermal... thermal load. For instance. Hmm. 
This leaf platforming doesn't seem like a great idea. Thinking about increasing the thermal loads of objects. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Ow. Damn it. Where's a jumping trebum when huh? Yeah, I'm surprised you still don't have your trebum powers right now. I haven't eaten anything particularly in a in a minute. I mean sure. Yeah, oh Okay. We're gonna have to make that journey from inside of the hedge, I think. Oof. And turn a journey. Yeah, I might have to actually make it from the, the hedge ascent instead of taking the back door as I was originally planning. Didn't they make a movie about this once? What was it called, Over the Hedge? Yes, you, you got it in one. It was called Over the Hedge. Oh, excellent. Cool. <laughs> Ow. But can you name the turtle that was in charge? Elvin, I think. You got it in one. Dang it. You I, do know over the head lore. I mean, he acted like a Melvin, I'll tell you that much. Apparently, back in the day, Melvin also used to be human slang for wedgie, so... Hmm... Trying to imagine giving... You can't give a turtle a wedgie. They're not wearing pants. Don't yeah, be silly. Yeah, imagine giving, imagining giving a turtle a wedgie with, like... Their fucking shell. Ow. Okay. That fall wasn't fatal. That's fine. Guess I'm making the other hedge ascent again. Out of bandages, so I'll have to kind of be careful. Don't kill me. Where is. I guess we're going all the way back to the hedge ascent. Can't think of any other way to get up there. Ugh. It's a shame that nobody thought to purchase the uh, Omnimint child-sized helicopter for putting all of these toys out in the lab for uh, Wendell. Yeah, wait a second. What's... There, there's an emergency going on. Hey! Build the helicopter! Yeah, there's, there is no Lego men coming to save me because if there were, they would have built the helicopter by now. Uh, this is just, this is what happens when you're not a citizen of Lego City. Oh, so it's my fault for not paying taxes? Is that um, what you're saying? Explicitly, yes. Oh. It is it your fault for not paying taxes to Lego City? If you had bought the Lego City, uh, fucking uh, helicopter set and the boat set and the police chase set, if well, you had bought those sets. So jot that down. I mean, yeah, but that also includes the guy that gets away. That is true. So you are funding, you are funding uh, pro-crime movements as well. Interesting. Yes, that is correct. You, you, you have to. Uh, you just, you just gotta, you just gotta uh, buy the Lego set, and then when you do that, build the helicopter. You... When, yeah, when you get shrunk down, you can just shout, hey, and then uh, the Lego men will build the helicopter and they'll come and save you. God, that sounds so nice, instead of living down in this fucking spider hell. Yeah, what if it, wait, maybe it's just because your character hasn't tried shouting hey yet. Is, there, like, is it like a, like a button that you can press that'll uh, get your character to shout like... The H button doesn't really seem to do anything, no. Hmm. 
sometimes they put it behind funny different buttons. Does the C button do anything? I'm pressing all the buttons I got. So. Uh, oh shit! Even yeah. here. I my my. I, I that button too. Ah fuck. Okay. I I guess if it's not, it might not be key to anything. Oh, they unbound my Lego reflex. Yeah, they unbound. Uh, they unbound the Lego uh, city. Yeah. How are we gonna get that um, guy out of the river now? <laughs> I guess he'll just be in there. Can you imagine if it was just just like no, we're not we're not going to build the helicopter. You're going to stay in there. Build river the guy. helicopter. No. I choose not to. I am not a slave. River guy is drowning. Please. No. I won't be manipulated. Simply simply put, I won't be manipulated. A Lego guy has drowned in the river. Build the build the horse. Build the coffin. <laughs> A man has died in Lego City. Perform the autopsy. A man has lived in Lego City. Eulogize him. <laughs> A corpse has been found in Lego City. Dispose of it. You found a zipline. I hope I don't fucking run into a berry and die like I do whenever I use these ziplines. Okay, so... Is that zipline over there go where I want to? Is there any way... That branch? I see a zipline there. Zip lines do be headed in directions. I don't know where it connects from. Issue. And I've once again done that thing where I've stranded myself in the hedge at night. I mean, you, you're used to surviving at night by now. Sure. Used to the terror of seeing a spider in the dark. That's a word, but... You can utilize your fear now. You can defeat them. I don't have a fear on limiter. I don't gain attack power when I'm terrified. Why not? You I'm didn't not take like that Shaggy perk? Rogers. Why didn't you take that perk? Because I don't make it a habit to be scared on the regular. Did, you didn't even... You're not even just gonna switch it out? Just real quick? Not even... Alright. Well... Enjoy... Enjoy not having a power boost from your fear aspect, I guess. Sorry, when did you install a fear aspect on me? What do you mean, when did I install a fear aspect? I didn't. I just found it in there. Wh and I started fiddling with it. When did you... So... Well, I wish you wouldn't like that without telling me. <laughs> I mean, it was set pretty high. Yeah, it's because I'm surrounded by bugs. Bugs are spooky. I thought it would be nice to turn it down a little bit, because you're spooky. You seem to have turned it into overflow mode. I'm the most terrified I've ever been. I can go back in and f sort of mess with it again if you want. No, oh, I, I think it's good where it's at. You sure? Yes. Okay. Quite certain. Well, let me know if you see a giant super spider. A what? With laser eyes or something. Hmm? You know, you heard me. I did. It sounds like maybe you, you know something I don't about the technological potential of the hedge spiders. 
What if what if spiders had missile launchers and guns? What if a spider could perform guerrilla warfare? What if spiders knew how humans thought and and could react to how humans thought by utilizing abilities? That's a great question. I think I'm farther away from what I actually frustrating. Is there anything you can find in here? I've already been to that particular lab. Could you potentially look up how I get to Birdbath Bluff from the Flingman disc? A very normal sentence. Bird bluff. Bird bath bluff. Grounded. I think there should be a place it's accessible from Let's over by see. the Flingman disc, but. There is a tree. I'm I'm gonna send you a map actually. I don't. That'll help. But I'll do my best. Here. Game. Map. Climb up the tree. Here. Problem is, I'm in the hedge for all of that. I think I've gone too far. Yeah, I think I've already. Oh, dang it. Let's see. Look for the field station, which is your first landmark. Uh, go left, go right past the field station. Uh, continue left path past the apricot puncho. Uh, while going up a narrow branch, you'll see a thicker one down below you. Jump down onto it. Keep heading to the left along these branches. Eventually, you'll see a small branch sticking out along the right. Jump onto uh, the bigger head branch back to the here. Field station, yes. Oh, hello, spiders. That's a lot of spiders. Or you're gonna run away from the spiders. E. Right. Guess I'll just head all the way back to the hedge ascent and just do it. Do it fresh from the hedge ascent. Spider, escape. Hedge, ascend. That's not where I need to go. Back. I also finally got the Blade Master perk. I think I might stick with swords, I'm not sure. What's Blade Master actually give you? Master. Ah, right. I didn't unlock it in this save. I have to kill some more enemies to re unlock it. Ah. Uh, Alright. See doodles. To the hedge of Sentigo. And I crap that out of. I need dry grass chunks. Oh no.
the slime lamp. the field station. Where am I going from the field station? Uh, you head... Let's see. Da, 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 da. Uh, go right past it. Right past it. So, milk mode. Great time. I think I'm going to upgrade my healing, because my healing is never as fast as I want it to be. Slurp the core, baby. Alright, we're going to the right. What after that? Uh, once you have headed right, uh, you will be looking for the Apricot Puncho, uh, which right. continues left. I I know how to get to the Apricot Puncho, I believe. Pretty sure. There it is. Then it'll be left past the puncho. Uh, I think here's where I have to take the big left to get to going, maybe. Let's see. Something at the end. Stick it. Uh, while you're going up a narrow branch, you'll see a thicker one below you. Very easy. So it's not going to be this branch here. I got to go further past the puncho. I'm not taking the zip line, right? No. In branch by the apricot. Ah, uh, I think. Drop down onto a thick branch? Yes. I think that's it. No. I can send you the image of the area we need to drop down. If you could, you know. I'm at the, the apricot puncho. There's just one path that leads to his and looking at it. Really know where that is. Because it does have you continue left past the poncho. Far left? Yeah, like far left. Mm. This hedge is fucking impossible to navigate. I genuine like there, there there's a lot of left to the to the juice box is the problem. just gonna look
show me yep field station Ah, I see now. Yeah, I'm in kind of the the wrong area entirely. Ah. Okay. Epcot Poncho. Past here. Yeah, the place where I dropped down is like right here. Think. Is there. Yeah, it's that thicker branch right there, I think. Maybe? I literally just watched someone do this, and yet... If the chose <sighs> I'll find my way there come hell or high water. Having to utilize secret techniques in order to find this location. The bluff. The sacred bird bluff. Well, I mean, the guy that you're going from is the most detailed thing in the world. It's like, find the fat branch! And it's like, okay. There's a lot of fat branches up here. I think they might have changed how you get to here since a lot of these videos were made as well because there's not a zip line in a lot of these videos it's part of the issue oh Mm. Yeah. No, you may have been giving me instructions that are only relevant to the old version of the game. They changed the game up? Yeah, they. this game was incredibly early access for a very long time. There used to be the capacity for orb weavers to just get up on these branches before they added spiderlings. Apricot pun. Yeah, they just. This area is just not the same area as you. Area has been changed. The world is different. It's nothing like what we knew before. The only choice now is to change as well. I guess I'm just gonna look on the. See if there's.
Yeah, there's a branch in the hedge lab, but other than that, there's no indication of how to get there. So, I guess I'll try and figure it out. I'd fuck, I don't know. Apparently there's a zip line near the Flingman disc that will help you get there, but that requires rope to patch, so... I might have to just abandon this stupid birdbath quest that has ruined my life. Birdbath quest, you have ruined our lives. For this, you are being abandoned. Be cast out. This whole area is so miserable, and I keep getting trapped here at night. I'm so tired of it. All this effort to avoid going in. Beginning to think I should have just gone in the goddamn lake. Oh, the lake. Why? Why does your siren call always sing to us? Well, it's because you're a weird fisherman. Mm, you can't prove that. Yeah? I, can only, I only fish sometimes, maybe. Yeah, and all these shirts in my home that say the only thing I love more than fishing is being a grandpa. You can't prove any of those are mine. Not one. Not yet. I'll have to find a court that will withstand my laser blasts first. Sorry, have you been... Why have you been laser blasting the courts? What, what did you do that got you called into court recently enough that you had to laser blast a court? I was caught laser blasting courts. Ah. Uh, well, I'm going to be honest, it sounds like maybe justice was served a little bit in this situation. Well, not really. They didn't manage to actually, you know, place the fine down because they laser blast the, the court. It was uh, sort of a catch-22 scenario. I laser blasted their only court, so they couldn't charge me for the crime of laser blasting their only court. That is an interesting conundrum. I think that is the zipline I need to get to, but I don't know where that zipline connects from. I'm going to test something. I just... Okay, in theory, yes. I might have to... I might have to save scum the hop tricks a little bit, but... Hop techniques. Go. Yeah, okay. I'm not... F fuck this zipline shit, this is for squares! We're doing extreme hang time parkour, baby! I'll figure out a way. This is why you bring along a dandelion. I I have straight up obtained bird bath madness. Bird bathness. Come on. Ugh. Baby. No! I might have to find a better vantage point. Mm hmm There may not be a better vantage point. I might not be intended to do this. Summon your powers and abilities and do it anyway. Defiance. Yeah, that's what a speedrunner would do.
don't know if I can make that. Come on. That leaf right there is the one I need. Nope! Fuck. Almost like they don't want me doing this. Nah, that can't be possible. No, you Damn it. You can do it. No, I can do it. It's just a matter of if I'm gonna do it before we all die of old age. Watch this human try to scrabble up leaves. Yeah, like looking at it, all of the guides online are just giving bad directions on how to actually get to this thing because uh, they're all for a version before the zip lines were added. Uh. Here? Bye. Beef danger strats. No! There. Oh, damn it! I just want it to be daytime. <laughs> I just want to be able to see again. This is a struggle. In the darkness, a struggle I'm for so survival. Sorry. Yes. Uh. Like, would it kill you to put some fucking lights up when... Wendell's not allowed to use lighting systems. That might subtract power from the muscle sprout. I don't think they need electricity for muscle sprouts. Yeah, they do. Uh... So says I, the Flying Dutchman. Oh. I didn't I don't realize... Know. Flying Dutchman got an opinion on muscle sprouts. I feel like a lot of people that aren't that aren't liable towards anything get opinions on Brussels sprouts. Fair enough. Lead somewhere. How would it ever lead somewhere? I would be so lucky. I'm just wondering, like, if I legitimately just had to go to the. I love this. I don't, hoops. I don't. I have been trapped in this hell for ages, hoops. I'll be honest, hoops. I'm personally pretty close to my fucking breaking point. What's the thing? That looks like it might be the thing. Oh, that leads to the lab. I think. Yeah. Supposed to be access from in there. so many of these little nerds. Well, there is apparently a hedge brood mother here, or whatever the hell one of them is. Could be any number of things. I wonder if it's one along with these branches. 
Because it looks like you can jump up that leaf and keep going as well. Oh, I sure can. Definitely a zip line here. That just leads down to the lab. Yeah. It looks like there's a way to get further up somehow, because there's still some untouched... Some raw science up there, yeah. Yeah. I'm glad I saved there. Good. George is a harsh lawn. Harsh, but fair. Yeah, low, I, low, I, I, well, not really fair. They've got uh, little tiny robots. I mean, uh, to be fair to George, I am not supposed to be doing most of the things that I've been doing this whole time. Damn it. There's no video evidence of the lab uh, branch that leads out of the bird bath is the only issue. Ah. Uh. So uh, I have no idea where it would be. What if when we get up there, we get an achievement of like, how'd you do this? Because it's not supposed to be possible anymore. Yeah, I get an achievement just titled, what's your problem? Oh, okay. Yeah, just... I'm gonna take that zipline, and I'm just gonna look around the lab at this point. <sighs> it turns out there's just, like, a door. Yeah, knowing my luck, I've been scrabbling around for something that was very easily findable. This is the best ever! I'm glad you think so, Hoops. Ah. So many spiders. Go way out of the top of the lab. Oh, hey, some silk rope. I should grab that. Uh, whoa! Delicious tannic acid. Nom, nom, nom. Tannic Wait, no, acid. that's not delicious. That's the opposite of delicious. That's bad. Fucking yucky is the word. Yucky acid. Black, gross, gross. Bye. On here, maybe? Okay. This branch. At least it's daytime again. It's fine. It. Also, this branch has like spider webs on it, so maybe. No, it's that branch over there, but where did the branch come from? Let's see. Can you glide down there from up here? It's the power of your. It's a long way, but I might as well try it, you know? think so. Yeah, like, I... I feel a little insane right now, if I'm honest.
Like, this non-Euclidean fucking hedge is keeping me from... Uh, from finding this now. Like... Ugh. Non-Euclidean hell hedge. Can you keep looking for a more up-to-date guide on how to get to this fucking thing? Because this is really bothering me now. I have to fucking get this. I've spent so much time on it. Let's see. Apple juice, okay, there's the apple juice. This one has the zip line, so it's up to date. Take the zip line. Hey, you know that zip line that we just kept walking around over back at the apricot? Yeah. We were supposed to took. take it. Yeah. Yeah. Um once we take that one. We jump down into some leaves. To sort of like traverse over to a large branch that's on the side. Let me show you uh, this video because this looks like it's up to date. Oh, I fell, so I can just take it back from the edge ascent again. Yeah. <laughs> this Feeling refreshed. I feel like Sisyphus. Weavers, I'm not a fear. Quest for the bird blast bluff. So, do you think you can tell me how to get up there if I get back to the apricot, or should I just tab out and watch the video you've uh, applied you to my to... brain? I can tell you how to get there. Okay. Get back to the puncho, theory. Yeah. Get back to the puncho, and then I can tell you how to go from there. Up I go. Sun rises. I spent a full night looking for an entrance to a bird bath. I'm at the Apricop. Okay. Go over to the zip line. Okay. Take the oh, zip line. One moment as I slurp this water and fill my canteen with juice. Zip line. Also on my sword master. Oh, that's cool. Ooh. Combo attacks with swords reduce the stamina attack of further combos. Oh, so it costs even less to fucking just go at it. Yeah. Alright, taking the zip line. Take the zip line. Once you've taken the zip line, immediately stop. I've stopped. Look to your left. Yes. See the big tree? Uh, yes, I see the branch. Yeah, that is the branch that you need to get on. So if you look to your left, left, left. No, 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 no. Yes, yes, that, that tree there. No, no, yeah, you are looking direct. Hmm. The one it under to me that I am, it occurs yeah, to me yeah, that I am behind. on a five second delay. Yeah. Um, let me... Okay, so stand by the zipline. 
Okay. I'm standing underneath the zipline. I am looking forward at a spider web. Look to your left. I'm looking to my left. Further to the left. You see the tree that is directly in front of you. The, those. the big massive, yeah, the big massive fucking like leaves and walls and shit. Yeah. That, that big round thing. Yeah. Yeah, the branch is sprouting out of that. You have to head directly forward. So I have to like do fucking leaf platforming? Yes, you have to do Epic. a little bit of leaf platforming to get to that branch that you are looking at on the pause screen. Yeah, I wasn't sure if there was going to be a fucking path or if it was going to be leaf platform. God damn it. Oh boy. The dandelion is apparently useful here. Yep. And we're going to save scum it too. Uh, bird bath. Bird bath. I am filled with such wrath. Bird wrath for the bird bath. I hope there's an easy path across because if I have to fucking switch my way across vertically. So I'm gonna... Well, the good news is that once you get over there, there's a zip line you can set up. That's yeah, real. Uh, I think that might be it. Get through this last wad of leaves. Please. Oh, I love this incredibly well-textured bundle of leaves at the base of this branch. Trash. Trash and poop is what this experience was. I don't even know where the other end of the zip line is supposed to connect to. I actually can't connect do this zipline. Do not, yeah, do not take that zipline. I can't. Um, keep your, I, yeah, I literally keep, can't. It is, yeah, un, just, it is unconnected and unconnectable. Yep, you just keep going down this branch. Uh. God damn it, there's mosquitoes here. I'm not dying to a mosquito minutes before my, before my penultimate victory! Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, let's see who's better at this big shit. Yeah. Milk molar. Hey, a mega milk molar. And then it'll be in the corner. Yeah. Uh, I got a flag, I think. Yeah. Scabby here too. Hedgeberry. Oh, hey, the mosquito finally made his way out of the bird bath. Skeeter. Ow. Oh. Okay. Yourself. Back here, coward. God, this guy's annoying. I know he is mosquito. Hey, fat boy. Yeah. Become concussed. Ow. Oh, I swear to God. He is becoming powerful. Mm. Oh, I might fucking die. God damn it. That was oh. awful! I'm gonna craft me a Hiobasa. I deserve a snack! Snacky.
Yobasa, go! Boppy. I like how you don't even eat it, you just fucking chuck it. Well, it is just a mosquito's blood sack. I don't know if that would be the healthiest thing for me eating. Please tell me I have enough resources to build this marker, because if I don't, I'm going to turn into the Joker. You will hear me turn into the Joker. You've got clover, right? I do have clover. Get the mega milk molar. Critical Barney, if you will. Close this, clo close this fucking, this nightmare chapter of my life for good. Please, God. Oh. Two hundred raw science. Was it worth it? Was Jump any of it worth lake, it? Jokey. Okay, Batman. Alright. Get fucking rolling. Actually do something this stream instead of just... ...suffering. You still got time left. You can still suffer a little bit if you want. Oh, really? Promise? Yeah. Promise. Hello, water flea. Attack me, it'll be the last thing you ever do, bud. I own a knife. What's your opinion on crushing, killing, and destroying? It's one of my favorite activities, other than finding bird bath bluff. You see, I spend all of my time doing it these days. Just looking for bird bath bluff, huh? Yes. Stuck a kernel in bird bath buff. Yep. I like that the water flea also turns evil. I like that the water fleas are, like, one of the only hostile enemies. I don't understand. Okay. I do like that you seem to just fucking, like, grab the water flea out from around its nucleus and unmake it. And yeah, the, the nucleus, nucleus is the best part! The nucleus just kind of rises to the top. All right, I know where Plank Cliff is. I can get there actually, real. So I'm also gonna get me some sprigs. I trash these venom arrows. They haven't really been all that helpful. No, no help from venom arrows. I want them to do a dot, but you know they don't. If your poison arrows don't do a dot, if poison is just a damage type your game has, we're not friends. You've made a, a bad game design decision, in my opinion. Just call it toxic. Yeah, exactly. And honestly, toxic should be a heavier version of poison that does percent max health damage, in my opinion. Finally getting some fucking Burgle quests done. Welcome. I'm gonna put a skull Burgle. here because I know there's a fucking wolf spider that's under here. Burgle will finishing your quests for you, Burgle. Hello, red ant. Ooh, cookie! Hang on. I can get some delicious fresh cookie bit. Don't need larva spikes. Now put the armament back ID back on. Not fighting spiderlings constantly. Delicious. Ants coming through. Hello, ants. Goodbye, ants. You're gonna have to find a different food source now. I'm sorry that I did that to you. 
sister's business, you know? Sorry, ants. We're going to have to unmake you, ants. Giving my enemies colony collapse Whoa. syndrome to flex on them. So, back home. Smoothie station. Can I? I don't have enough materials. For... I have a bunch for fuzz on the rocks, which is good. Because that'll actually be useful when I go to go fight thing. Delicious. Fuzz on the rocks. Um. I think what I'm gonna do now, first of all, quick stack all this garbage out of I'd like my thank you. Sort I heard something sing with my friends. Alright. So I have the Mertine mutation, so I'm going to take off, uh... i take off buff lungs. I'm gonna stick on Mertine. And I am going to stick on... Armoring up. My swimming helmet. My fin. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go hunting. Okay. And, uh, specifically, I'm not going hunting for, like, a thing that you would hunt for. Uh, harm it. I'm specifically, uh, going to go hunting around the pond just for stuff that I missed down there. Remember how we had that plan at the start of the stream? And then... You know. And then? The bird bath? The, the bird madness got to me a little? And yeah, and then the bird bath madness happened. Yeah, I remember. I remember our, our plan. Odd one of us does. Mm. But while I'm here, I craft a. Oh! Mm -hmm. I guess I could summon the brood mother if I wanted to get slaughtered by the brood mother. Do you really think he'll be just slaughtered by the broodmother like that? I mean, I'm willing to bet she's like times larger. That'd be rude though, wouldn't it? Just get slaughtered by a broodmother. You got to I mean, breathe, I'm not her. Also, you want to know what I think is pretty funny? Yeah? I don't know one of the names of one of the other kids in this game. Yeah. Yeah, there's a kid in this game, uh, his name is Max. Uh, it's, uh, short for Maxwell. Uh, and his last name, would you like to guess what his last name is in this game about being, uh, shrunk down to a uh, smaller size? Is it Maxwell Biggs? No, it's Maxwell Small. Ah. Uh, well. Well, sorry, Max Small. Yeah. Max Small. Also, uh, apparently our name is not, in fact, Hoops. Like, that's just a nickname we have. Yeah. Uh, and it's funny because I'm pretty sure she is the only character who doesn't have, like, their funny joke nickname being, like, their actual name. Because I'm pretty sure mm. in the case of Willow Branch, she actually has a voice line where she goes, Yeah, don't make any jokes about that. I've already heard them all. Oh. Hmm. Can't mix soda and juice. The game gets very upset if you try. Why not? Cherry soda exists. Why not blueberry soda? That's not cherry. That's um, the, the flavor that they put in the soda to make it like that is actually blood. What? Yeah, TV so. Coming through. There's no blood cartons on the lawn. Oh. Yeah. Come mm, on. Still some from a uh, mosquito. That is true, I do have the heal bosses that I've been making. Just mix those with the soda. Oh, 
lot of ant parts in here that I just kind of forgot about. Heal my soda. Problem is. Yeah. What's wrong with waking up in the dark? Just means you get to go right back to sleep. It's. That's the thing. Since we are a growing team, this game does have a mechanic by which you will be you will be too awake to sleep again. Uh Well, probably some stuff down here. This went pretty fast with the merchant, so that's nice. Over here. Let's open. Go into the pond lab. Wonder if. Yep, Wendell's wedding ring is definitely still down here. Or his Wendell. wife's wedding ring, rather. Womp wah. That's kind of sad. Sunken pot. I can't believe Wendell tossed his pot into the goddamn lake. Horrible. Yeah, diving bell spider, I'm gonna outswim you, I think. I can actually just do that. It's... Hello. Huh. I guess that's just a things from swimming in there. I'm getting increasingly worried that the fish has seen me just waiting to make its move. Hmm. I think it'll be more obvious if the fish has seen you. It'll be like, oh, f fish has spotted you. Yeah, I wonder if there's specific fish horror music. That would be very in character for this game, I think. Having Bell Spider under here. Fun, nice little swim. Mr. Spider, please don't bite me. They're going to bite you. I am just on a, I am just on a little swim. Uh, that was the distinctive blow of a milk fruit, I'm pretty sure. All right, boys, you're in the way of me and my vitamins. I need my vitamins. Vitamins, I've got them. Right. Need a mini. Air. Torch is kind of quick. It's not great. Raw science. Raw science. Oh, lab pipe. Here we go. This is actually very helpful. I can come in here, I can refuel if the Muscle sprouts have respawned. I can fill my horrible body with more muscle sprouts. I don't know how to feel about the fact that they hit back, but... You know, they just need to be processed first. 
They haven't regrown yet. Got some funky beats going on in your life. depths are actually where I want it to be, so that's actually quite okay. One of these leads to... This one that leads to the bedroom? Yeah. Resources left in. grass down here. Oh, slime mold stalks. That's actually good. Might not have left stuff I need. No slime down here. Yeah, there's some slime mold. I don't think I have an, uh, any lily pad wax is the actual issue. Ah. Wonder if these work on. I guess I'll cry about it. Slime Lantern. I might actually be able to use that as well. Ugh. I've had worse, I guess. Ash uh, this bad one. Chunks right now. Alright, let's see if this slime torch is waterproof. Excellent, it is. Just gonna be really short lived, so. That's fine. I think five. Sunrise in this horrible backyard. Beautiful sunrise. 30 minutes away. 30 in game minutes away. Glad no one's tried to uh, harvest the, the genre of the, uh, the real time survival game yet. Don't say that. Someone will think to. Yeah, get my hand off the lathe, you're right. I think there is... Potentially... Stuff back here. Oh, it's dark back here. Torch is not very bright under. Alright, Macy still functions, I suppose. Oh. Which is there, benefit. There's a hole here. A hole? Yes. Hmm. Tunnel. Secret tunnel. Spider! I need the oxygen. And, uh, 
Thankfully, I can still eat sandwiches from my inventory when I'm this far under. Get that Billy Hog down. Okay, there's a lot of spiders in here. That's not great. There's a uh, oxygen zone. Yep. Could attack this. I just don't want to die to the spiders. Is my main thing. Where's your diving bell, Stinky? Oh boy. Uh. Okay, retreat, retreat a little. <laughs> My health come back a little bit. No mm. labar. Can't waste food. Can't waste food. Can't waste food. There we go. I think that Fuchs is still worried about wasting food even in this dire situation. Uh, well, apparently Hoops is the kind of kid, uh, their parents don't let them have soda. So... Oh. Yeah. You know. They've probably got a, a different perspective on, uh, all of the, the food storage and whatnot that we have to do. Because uh, this this uh, Omnimen shrink shrunk soda is the first time that uh, they've ever actually had soda. Mossy key. Also, yeah, looks like uh, the key for that box as uh, I was looking for. It's a nightmare cave. I think I found most of the things that I actually wanted to find now that I found that mossy key. Where's that box? It's back this way, right? Probably uh, also the abomination cave somewhere in here, but I'll be honest, I, I'm a little scared finding that one. You don't want to attribute to Caillou? Uh, killed by beasts? Uh, killed true. by stink bugs? Was killed by stink bugs. We do have, to, we do owe him, I suppose. All right, sunken chest open. Milk mode, Urkel chip. Just gotta survive. I believe the abomination cave is somewhere in the northernmost section of the lake. I can head to the normal section of Ick. Safe. Keep going. Fish might be turning soon. The tadpoles. Oh, I'm sort of just gonna scan over here, see if I see anything, and if I don't, I'm gonna exit the water. Because Caillou is not worth the kind of effort the bird bath was. The fish has seen me. Okay, good to know that the fish makes a very distinct noise when it becomes aware of you. Oh boy. That fish roared at me. Ooh. Noted. Oh, some marble shards. That's a good. Too. That's at least the main. Okay. I'm 
basically at the northernmost section of the uh, pond. Not sure where this cave would be. If I hadn't looked up the location of that first cave, I don't think I ever would have. Hmm. Well, let me see, just in case. to be at a there's going to be a leaf next to the pond skimmer ah uh, okay and then right underneath that leaf there'll be a little crack in the rock that leads to a cave okay swim my mouth I get fucked. These be spiders. Okay. Save since it's been a minute. I'll shamelessly save scum my way through this entire game if I missed. Pawn skimmer, right over here. A little careful, because the fish comes pretty close to the pawn skimmer. I think it's this leaf directly in front of you, actually. So there'll be a crack in the rock, you see? Down below? Yep, down below. Just go... Down? Down and then behind you, on and in, in like the rock wall, might be upwards a little bit more. I'm just worried, which is close-ish. Oh, here we go. Here we are. Oh, there's a bunch of uh, disembodied ant heads down here. That's fucking scary as shit. Holy oh. fuck. Uh. Hmm. Okay. Uh. I think one of the other kids might have been living down here. If I had to, like, take a take a guess. Oh. Uh. Oh, I don't even have a high enough tier tool to actually, uh... Supreme Marble. Um. Alright. Guess I'm getting out of the fucking water. I'm gonna try and keep that slime lantern from disappearing, because it's a rotten slime lantern, so I think I can technically analyze it for three raw science. Oh. Hello, fish. Goodbye, fish. Oh boy, I think it saw me. Okay. Get on the pond skimmer. Get on the pond skimmer. Alright. Bunch of mosquitoes over there, but... Ugh. Come on! Ga 
god, she's loud. And terrifying. Ooh. I'm gonna take off Mertine. I'm actually gonna put on Chopper. I think the axe might actually just be a legitimate at this stage. Excuse me. Skeeter. Skeeter. Alright. So... Bond operations have been successful. Yes. Yes. We have we have we have done many a pond thing. We want to keep going. I do have one more thing on the docket for us to go. Uh, what's the thing on the docket? I think while I have my water gear out, I think there is a way that we can get into the haze lab through a broken pipe uh, that will not require. Uh, yeah, we might as well. A, a, a rat burst. We, I, I feel like we owe the people something to make up for yeah, the bird let's, incident. Let's sneak our way into the haze lab and save our way in there. Bank all of my crap real quick. Get some more plant fiber so I can make... Guzzling those things like they're fucking candy. Your kid's just a fucking mummy by this point. I mean, if the bandages are thick enough, they, will, they won't be able to stab me through. That's just... that's just reason. Whoa. Logic. You described cloth armor. Yeah. I mean, try stabbing someone with a relatively crappy knife through their shirt. It's not gonna happen. Huh? Oh, also, grab hand. your helmet while you're yeah. here, yeah. yeah. When I'm back at the base, uh, I think one of the things that make some uh, delicious, delicious muscle sprout, mite, and clay smoothies. Now, that sounds like a delicious meal of vitamin, proteins, and minerals. Yeah, you know, vitamin protein. The mineral everyone needs. Soda drop. Nathan, sorry. Do you think soda would be poisonous to a human at this size? I think it'd be sticky like a molasses. Do you think they'd be able to, in, like, tell the difference between droplets of water and droplets of syrup at this size? Oh, absolutely. Syrup would be dangerous like tar. Huh. And don't even fucking get me started on tar. So do you think you could pull soda syrup back out of the soda? Yes. Hey, fuck you! Larva! No. Larva, thinking they can try shit. Crunch. The only Holds thing about the sword heart. is, uh, the, the, the amount of damage yeah, yeah. this sword deals definitely suggests to me it's been nerfed before. Like, the, uh. the amount of healing it gives and the amount of damage it deals. Because, uh, looking at the wiki, there's a bunch of people complaining in the comments about, like, Oh, this sword used to be goaded, but they ruined it. Ah. Uh, Which, you know, Probably too funny. efficient. Yeah, probably. Uh. Oh, I can make a black ant shield, excellent. Things that I was thinking I should make. Right. Upgrading I can do. Did I upgrade an entirely different ant helmet? Did I? 
do a smart and not do that. Excellent, I didn't do that. Proud of myself for that one. Alright. I should probably go give Burgle his chip back, actually, before I go on any big quests. I forgot that I, uh, got some Burgle chips. And the knife can actually go into storage. Actually, I'm going to a place with water. I shouldn't take that out of my hand. I've had worse, I guess. Having a thing. A fuzz clay pepper. I'll have to start picking up more clay when I see it. Clay. So delicious. Surprised it's still so important at your size. Well, clay is delicious no matter what size you are, you know? This is, I think, the most prepared I've ever gone into anything. my gas mask in case it's stinky inside of the laboratory. Uh, I should craft another torch. It's stinky inside the laboratory. It's hot in the... You ever see that episode of My Gym Partner's a Monkey? I thought it was an episode of Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. You're completely correct. I'm the fool here. Can't believe this. I think I was once again confusing it in my brain with the asbestos episode of My Gym Partners, uh, which was definitely a joke that kids could, could get. That was definitely a choice that they made. Right, got a perch. Got all my smoothies, which I will. Yeah. It was an eight, because I don't actually. What else, what else, what else? Gonna go give Burgle his chip. My buddy Burgle, who deserves all the presents, kindness. Mm. Burgle, Can't would you sleep? like some of your brain back? Can't we sleep? How much of it? All of it? Well, I can't fix that. What do you think would happen if we just put like a cartridge of Glover into Burgle? Uh, I think he would explode. Really? Yeah. You don't think he can handle the awesome power of Glover? 
Uh, no, I think it's that he would handle it too well. He would realize that he was not made for this world and he would explode. Oh. He, he would self-destruct so he, so he could go be Glover? Or? Yeah, so he could join, go join the Gloververse. Yeah. Oh, I see. The, the Gloververse. Interesting. Yes. Yes, the infinite zones of Glover. Grabbing more sap because I'm actually stuff for once. Which, once again, genuinely shocks me. Oh, mushrooms. Grow back so well. Yeah, I'm glad that they continually grow back and none of them are poisonous to me. Burgle. Clean, there's experimentation I to have be a done. chip for you, my friend. It is nice to see a pal. Can I help you today? Do you see it, Burgle? The I chip also, for you? I had another ah, dream. More of your fragmented memories. Let us stack them together like the ingredients of a burger. Okay. Stack them together like the ingredients of a burger. Now that's what I call quick they thinking. They are a common side effect of the shrinking process. Huh. The memories, that is. Apparently Not losing your memory is a common side effect of the shrinking process. To understand the world. Not burger metaphors, which is simply how I have programmed... Burgle, I'm so sorry. Uh, scientists were experimenting were on me when I was tiny. Science manual, it is likely they were documenting side effects of the shrinking process, of which there are a few. Sorry, the Omniment Science Manual says just do it to people until you know all the problems? Short-term memory loss, constipation, dehydration, among other minor ailments. Hey, wait. Constipation, dehydration. Do you think the shrinking process literally forces water out of your body and that's why we're so goddamn but thirsty the all the time? Side effects, Nothing to worry about, my friend. Teeny tiny, you that's how it keeps you small. It shrinks your dinks. Meat patty. <laughs> I'm looking fresher than a non-frozen meat patty. Uh, that could mean a lot of things depending on where the Project patty Orc? has been being left. That is certainly not something that Dr. Tully ever discussed with me. Ominent requires its scientists to use code names for their projects. Eventually, the marketing department. Oh, I'm so glad that science is done up. by marketing departments in Ominent. I heard one scientist just used American state names in chronological. Oh. Out loud! What a magnificent scheme! But I digress. Whatever Project Org is, the name does not sound good. Uh, Ominent Remote Control. They're gonna build a controller that can turn off your TV from 10 miles away. How can I help you today? Here's a chip, ah, Burgle. more chips! Thank you! Welcome, buddy. Oh, and Burgle. Ever, and you know so many things now. Mm, much better! Check the ASL Terminals Science Shop for the new recipes. Fare thee well, Burgle! Aha. Thank you. It's not the ASL term, but analyze that lantern. Hmm? This is a lantern. It's fucking rotted. And trash that. Bye. Resource surveyor. I always have trouble finding the ASL term. Ooh, I, got, I forgot I got another uh, Mega Molar so I can upgrade my uh, consumable stacks. Actually, hmm, I'm gonna upgrade, upgrade resource stacks actually because that I have so many inventory problems. I remember it was actually pretty funny. I saw a uh, a review for this game that said it was a bad game because they didn't let you upgrade your inventory and it was really annoying having a clogged inventory all the time. 
That's how you can tell someone didn't get to the part of the game where you, uh, you know, Upgrade find milk rollers. Yeah. Plant foundation, base, flat burst recipe. Oh, fin flop upgrade. It's neat. Wish I had gotten those before. Guess I'll finally get fortified bases. I can, uh, if I get bored off stream, I can start building myself a proper, uh, palace. Now, I said I wasn't gonna try and live here forever, but it's looking like I might not get a choice in that particular matter. Back to palace. It's a palace now? Well, it's gonna be a palace because I am going to be adding palisades to it, which. That does I make mean, things a palace. If palisades don't make a building a palace, what legally speaking does? Actually, now that I have a shield, I'm going to go back to using it. Because the stamina savings will be good for my ability to defend myself. Hello, ants. Glad you all are not mad at me for all the murder. I've had worse, I guess. I understand that, ugh, I've had worse, I guess, specifically for the mushrooms. Raw mushrooms sound pretty bad. Yeah, they're alright. I what? said through a mouth of softly chewed mushrooms. Softly chewed? Just yeah. letting them percolate in there? I give them a nice chew once every 15 minutes. Ah, I see. Gab, have I ever told you you're the most normal light processor that I know? I'm the most normal being to ever exist on all time. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you're very normal. And we love you for for my character to actually sleep. I take some granola bars with me. Okay. We sort all my storages now that all of my stack sizes are different. Patch up some of the incredibly large holes that I've left in basically all of my powerful hole. I do have one of them. You don't need to tell everyone. I mean, how else are the ants going to get in? 
Well, ideally, we don't want the ants to get in. That is actually the opposite of the point. Oh, we're keeping the ants out now. Yeah. I I've decided can. I don't appreciate the fact that they don't pay me taxes. Ah, they do not pay taxes. Yeah, I think they should. Feeling refreshed. I have been told I can find what I'm looking for to the west of the picnic table. So let's see if that's true. Think hell. Don't want to be in stink. You're going to have to be in stink hell. I want to go to stink heaven instead. Yeah, what's the stink of stink heaven? It smells like strawberries. It's wonderful. Strawberries, huh? Yes. Also, thankfully, I have that gas badge, so Stinkbug is not actually instantaneous death anymore. Just rapid death, you know? You know. <sighs> Manageable kind. Any black ant soldiers? Seeing if we can take them. If I can get a tier three shovel, everything changes. I can go get some gum. That lets me do some fun stuff. Like, uh, I think I can seal up the haze canister if I can get gum. Another thing. Is that a good or a bad thing? I mean, it won't be poison over there anymore. That. to that thing. Can. Oh, can. Another can of beverage made by Omnimment, it looks like. Get in there somehow. Yeah, we're looking for an exposed sprinkler pipe. There's another aphid. Oh, I see a pipe. Big wet 
pipe. Oh yeah, they actually modeled it like splintering like PVC does, because uh, PVC sort of splinters more than uh, like properly shattering in a really weird way. Exposed pipe. I think there's another one of these somewhere else in the yard. Possibly, well, not possibly, probably by the other, uh, sprinkler. But I haven't looked around there terribly. There hasn't been reason to. There's only two directions to go, huh? Directions in both ends seem clogged. Is there an underground Ooh. section? One looks like one has an underground section you can go through. Oh, yep, I didn't even see this little, like, secondary underground breach down. Hey, keeper. Yeah, Hoops put the torch away. It's not gonna help. Oh, hang on a second. Minotaur key. I might. This is not what I was looking for, but... Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna go get the contents of that fucking box if there's not any bees up there. It's supposed to be... Well, I go retrieve the contents of the Minotaur's fucking treasure, uh... Did you look to see if I'm um, in the, the right pipe? Uh, if you look up the Hayes lab on the wiki, there should be... It should say the two ways you can get in. Look for the ex one of the exposed pipe landmarks near the border of the sandbox and the Hayes. Safety okay. first. Sandbox and the Hayes. gonna kind of be the there another are exposed so pipe or is it just, root. is it just this exposed pipe like right there's above the two sandbox. different ones there are a pair of landmarks ah there's okay the minamar there's the minotaur maze key pipe and then the haze pipe okay so i will follow that pipe along i guess that seems like a idea I'm not going to take a bunch of sorry full. The pipes were little. dug up and damaged by Dr. Wendell Tully did him being raged at his wife hiring a professional to fix the sprinklers. Yeah, apparently he kept putting it off um, due science and then he got freaked the fuck out because uh, the, uh, the pipe fixing people worked for Omnimen. <laughs> oh. Because Omnimen apparently owns basically fucking everything in this town. You know, it's able to kidnap kids, so... Let's see if I can't just sprint past these bees. I've tried this before, and it didn't go so well. Yeah? Alright, get blocked, idiots. Alright. That's the safest I've ever made it up here. Alright, the Minotaur's maze, baby. I hope it's not full of fucking bees. The Minotaur's maze. Already been through here. Crow feather. Eat it right now. Humble. Ah. Get out of here, 
here, buddy. Give me the. shield's actually coming in a lot of handy. I, I was kind of uh, assuming that it wouldn't be so useful. Powerful shield. Mr. Bungulus B, could you... Yes. Do it. Ow. It's okay. Not great. Oh, don't get stinky at me, sir. Goodness. All right. These bees, no respect. Can I roll the d20? <laughs> Let me roll the d20. <laughs> d20 is too dang heavy. Oh, hang on. Oh, come on. Yeah. Come on. Come on. We did it. We rolled a fucking... Huh? Coup de gras. Uh... Huh. Oh, critical hit chance. Uh, God damn it! That's a that's a really funny joke, actually. Hey, Nat twenty. Also, ooh, Minotaur maze treasure is full of fucking marble shards. All right. Now that mega milk, <laughs> but not the bad kind. Go find the pipe, then do the haze lab, and uh, if the haze lab goes quickly, I will uh, maybe return the Minotaur chip to Burgle as well. That's uh, the final itinerary for this last bit of stream. <laughs> Love how you kind of can't get around the picnic table without just breaking your arms constantly. Just gotta okay. fall. One breached pipe. Do I need to go further towards the haze or further towards like? I think it's uh, like between the haze and the. Ah. Uh... Like over there, maybe. Yeah. Yep. There's a sprinkler there. I bet there's probably the sprinklers probably uh. The sprinklers probably mark the locations of the pipes because I think Wendell broke all of the sprinklers and that's why his lawn is so goddamn flooded. Not me, sir. Bombardiers are still actually kind of dangerous because they're incredibly aggressive and their poison does damage. Just Choose like in real life. Choose you out of range by f you. Wow, he really left like six different wow. trowels just scattered <laughs> so scattered like around the yard, huh? Fifty zombies wadded up their gym shorts and stuffed them in this pipe. Armor protection, engage! Oops. 
I have questions. Mostly, what's your favorite horror movie? You seem like a pretty Whoa. cool kid. Getting in the hole. Uh, I'm gonna actually equip a knife on the hot bar before I get in the hole. Getting in the hole. Oh boy. Hmm. Did I neglect to make a lamp before I came? Slime. Damn. I'm gonna try and make this swim blind. I'm gonna hope it doesn't go horribly. Don't think there are any enemies in here. It's just, you know, blocked off with reeds or whatever. Slime torch. Yes. Thank Bam. you. Alley hoops bringing okay, light. Alley hoops has the mold. Oh, wrong way. Okay, back this way. It's me, Mr. Waterflea. Oh, there's definitely fungus in here. Excuse me, boys. Oh, hello. Fleas that have been slowly chasing you. Yeah, right? Is there a turn I have to make? Let's go the way that was treasure. Exit. There's some haze fungus here. Let's craft a mini, please. Ah, here we go. Ow. My ass. Excuse me, boys. You can tell the fucking, um... This pipe is fucked up with how much roots are in it. Yeah, right? I'm beginning to think the problem with the sprinkler system is that Wendell Tully let it get filled with plants. Also, I appear to have found the haze lab. Uh, I am now going to swap my bubble helmet for my gas mask. Just in case, you know? Oh, fuck me. The weevils! My goodness. What have they done to these boys? I see one of those weird weevils up ahead. 
Ah, oh, they're all going sicko mode. Oh, he's dreadful. Huh. Oh, evil. Ah! Right, I forgot the fucking strange spore things also just burst over time. Fuck. Aw, oh, science. Uh, that's bones. That's human bones. That's dead man. Hey, guy. A, guy, a guy died here. Hey, guy, what's up? Oh, that's actually really good. A defense badge. Uh, yeah, trash that. Have a photo. D. Reed. If I ever get my hands on that Schmechter, I'll snap him like a dry billy hog. They snap when they're dry? Ugh. He was breathing down the commander's neck for months about that wackadoo orc project. Jumped up his buns so bad about it being the future of warfare. Not sure how I drew the short straw, but getting voluntold for what seemed like a pretty normal mission. Occupied base camp, groundwork for orc, babysit pencil necks, do light recon, don't spill the beans. The wilderness is some fired dude's large hostile yard packed with nightmare predators and crazy experiments. Your base is casually visited by a 400-foot child, and none of the nerds you're stuck with want to work together, so you're on your own out here. Small arms and light weapons don't work at this scale. Hope you're good with sticks and stones. Also, you're gonna shrivel up like fingers in the bath. Here's your one-way ticket. Wait, what? Yeah, you, you have to shrink down for it. Well, not only that, but I think, like... The way that was phrased implied that, like, Omnimen hasn't figured out how to enlarge people either. But, like, Tully was working on it, but Omnimen themselves don't actually know how to enlarge anyone, it sounds like. Ah, uh, so they're just shrinking people down? Yeah. And sending them over to fucking spy on us to see if they can discover a way to... Yeah, fucking... We're on that, on that disposable scientist lifestyle like, with Omnimen, I guess. I fought those tasties very badly, but it's because I couldn't put my thing away to get my club out. Sprouts out of here. Get the club out, because it's robot fighting time. Trump? Mushroom. Mushroom behind the glass. Cell age and mushrooms seem to be going Sorry. Well. Reverse cell age? Volatile, but productive. The shift from phase oh. one to two was Volatile almost but productive, a blur. Huh? There might be a reason it seemed like a blur, if I may be so bold. Well, who asked you, Burgle? Shouldn't you be tending to your tasks instead of eavesdropping to the intercoms? Huh? Now... Where was I? Sounds like Tully's sanity has declined oh, quite yes. a bit. My friends, Morasmius Oriatus here. Morasmius Oriatus. Is, is that a that real mushroom? Supple flesh. And once I have it, I'll be back to normal Wendell in no time. Just like it oh. was before this all fell apart. Uh. I walk in that presentation room and show those animant. <laughs> Dominant schmucks, I belong. Oh, dear. How do you like that, Director Schmechter? So, Trudy and the kids will come back. Everything will be back to normal. Wendell's been drinking, I it would seem. I just need these blasted shrooms to reveal their secrets to me. Oh. Forgive me, Dr. Tully. Did Trudy you and the kids have left him by the time he's working in here. That's unfortunate. Yeah. You know, they're they're at mom's as it It seems apparently Tully has been losing raw science every time he shrinks and unshrinks. So him looking like a wet ham was not actually just the stress. Trudy was right. As always. Perhaps Yes, she your wife is right about me. whatever you're talking about. 
I should have listened to her when she insisted that I stop the experiments. But if I pack it up now, I will have nothing to show for it. No Trudy and the kids, no spacer, not even my own health. Oh, literally, oh, I've gone too far for it, even though I've realized that my wife was correct. Raisoning. But why? Raisoning. What am I becoming? A wrinkly oh. virus, flailing helplessly in the dark of mushrooms. They are my family now. Though we only branched on the evolutionary tree a little over a billion years ago, I can feel us getting closer again already. We're all a bunch of fun guys down here, aren't we? So Tully's losing it. Like that. It sounds like. No one ever heard of raisin mushrooms, did they? Did they? Wait a second. Okay, um... Yeah? Tully actually had kind of a smart idea here. It sounds like he's undergoing raisining, which sounds like maybe he's literally losing, like, a little bit of his... Whatever raw science is, you know, he's losing a little bit of it every time he shrinks and unshrinks, right? Yeah. But... Mushrooms don't have, like, mushrooms have uh, keratinous cell walls. That's why it's really hard to overcook them. So maybe he was actually studying the mushrooms because, like, he, he, he thought they would, they would help him, like, keep himself from raisining. Cool ideas. Edible mushrooms that talk. You are so smart, Wendell. Hi. Hmm, <laughs> I think Wendell's losing it. Uh, he was drunk when he did this, I think. Uh, yeah, no, beer, sponsored by Slapshot Beer. It's too hard to open a bottle, so put a lid in the bottom so you can just pour it down your gullet. Well. I guess we know where that fucking fungus came from. I wonder if the weed killer was him trying to kill it. Cause he should know better than to try and use a surface toxin on something with a mycelium. That, that's that's basic botanical warfare 101, my guy. Uh. Goodbye, Wendell. What can I say in this letter that we haven't argued about the last few years? Is there anything left to talk about? It breaks my heart to admit it, but we need a change. I'm sorry, I just can't take the tears anymore. I can't bear the look of disappointment on our children's faces night after night when I'm pretending it's going to get better. So we're going up north to my sisters. I need the time to think and decide what happens next. Please don't call me. I won't answer. If you want to talk about where we go from here, you'll have to pull yourself away from your work and drive. I'll always love you, Wendell, and I hate that we've ended up here, but here we are. Please take care of yourself and don't forget to eat something healthy now and again. You're not yet ex-wife Trudy. I'm beginning to have sympathy for Wendell. Knowing that he's not the one serial killing children, I'm beginning to have sympathy for Wendell. Wendell. Because I think it was Omniment that was turning the children into Wait, soup. Maybe the reason he's not here to fucking help you is because he literally managed to pull himself away from his work and is making the drive up to go talk to Trudy. And if that's actually the case, that would be the funniest fucking thing in the world. Like, oh, there's there's children in the back. Yeah. Oh, oh. The one dear. time I managed to fucking pull myself away. Yeah, right. Also, I've got a second level of the Natural Explorer perk, so I'm even faster now. Thank God. Speed. All right, so we got the granola bars. There. Ah. That leads down to where I came from. There's gotta be a super chip down here, right? Yeah. There's the haze chip. Ah, oh right, that, that wire. So that, yeah. that path does lead somewhere new. I'm gonna rearrange my hotbar a little bit. Actually, I have a strange feeling I'm gonna need to do combat soon. Violence. Murder. I wanna have my smoothies on six for quick heal. Follow this wire. 
Yep. This thing's open now. Phase three results. Mutations and explosive. Mutations and oh, phase three are progressing at rates I can't begin to quantify, and they've spread to the local fauna. Words can't express the sorrow I fear for these simple creatures warped and manipulated into ravenous, horrible, exploding beings. Attempts to reverse or even slow the changes in the strange spores or the creatures it has spread to haven't been fruitful. I'm tasking Burgle with keeping an eye on all this and introducing security defense procedures to keep the lab safe. Catastrophic as it may be, my confidence in raw science as a catalyst for growth is sealed now. Huh. Oh, is this what inspired him to start fucking working with the... the... muscle sprouts? I... think from the muscle sprouts, like... while he was working on the muscle sprouts, he realized that he was fucking, like... dying? And, uh... Then I, gotta... Yeah. He, he he has done the mushroom research to try and fix fix his his, his weird body. Sorry, I'm there's a fucking there's a ladybug here. Uh oh the ladybug is aggressive. Don't blow me up, don't blow me up, don't do it. Oh. I think it might spit on you, Oops. I think it might. Oh. Is that guy a fucking boss fight or something? Uh, it looks like yes. Get parried, fool. Ooh. Oh, the smoothie! Drink the smoothie! Alright. Hello, ladybug. Ow. I don't want to get blown up. Ah! I'm glad I brought the fucking smoothies, holy cow. Don't die. Not like this. Gross ladybug here. Yeah, it sure is. Ow. Hm. I'm gonna play it safe and eat a granola bar, get my health back. Ooh. Ah! Ruffle tussle. Ow. More infected mites, huh? Uh. Might as well get the mite fuzz while I'm here. Come on, man. Done. Oh. So yeah, I think that was a boss fight, judging by the purple health bar and how it had attacks that I don't think I've seen from the uh, the normal ladybugs. Motherfucker. More mites, huh? Yeah, that specific one uh, was apparently a boss. They're 
others that you can encounter rarely that do not spawn infected mites. Uh, will they still do the fucking, uh, the, the, the viral howitzer thing to you? It's much beefier, but it will. Damn. So, the one that you encountered was much beefier. The the regular ones they encounter out in the wild are about as strong as regular ladybugs. Truffle Tussle. Yeah, I should check what that actually does. Um, first of all, I would like to take off... I'll take off... Master for now, I'm putting Lucy back on. Unarmed attacks have a chance of creating a fungal explosion, <laughs> damaging anything in its radius. Huh. That's a little weird, but I like it. Or I like the idea of it, at least. Slime mold. I get rid of that. Well, I think we found the haze chip. Blazed Earth Protocol. This has gone poorly. Oh boy! Very, very poorly. The essence of failure, the pinnacle mm. of its craft. Local essence fauna? of failure. Berserk. Mushrooms exploding. Maybe don't do ultra science when like you're drunk, Wendell. Like a baby toe after a long bath. What? Burgle, are you there? Is this a test? Yes, Burgle, it's a test. Now listen carefully. I'm abandoning this facility immediately. Initiate the Blazed Earth Protocol. But Dr. Tully, simulations indicate a 95.283% probability of catastrophic failure. I assure you, the percentages are much higher than that. Now do it. <laughs> beep, beep, boop, beep, 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 boop. Makes pretend Why beeping make sounds. Why beeping sounds? You said this was a test. I was being sarcastic. Yeah, this was a test. <sighs> Complete the lab lockdown, blast the canister per protocol, I love and meet Burkle. me in the Black Sweet Ant Burkle. Lab. The Black Ant Lab, huh? Gee. I'm not gonna swim back without my helmet on. I'm not gonna risk that. Oh. So, uh... It looks like we accidentally just kind of stumbled into and Power fought protection. a boss. Engage. I will say, I feel pretty good about. Defeated. Um, I am going to, uh, I think, get this stuff back to Burgle, and then it will be uh, time for uh, end of stream, I think. Ow. I will, I will return Burgle's things to him, and then I will return to our base. And uh, I don't know if you noticed, because I didn't draw a super big amount of attention to it, but uh, one of the things that we definitely found um, in there, which was super excellent, was uh, three Brat Burst Bombs. So I don't actually have to go into the anthill no. at all. Yeah, we can just kind of... I'm going to take the long way out, in fact, so I can I can save a Brat Burst. I don't die doing this like an idiot. I may. An idiot. Excuse me, boys. Ow. Go back for those slime mold stalks I left back here. It's dark down here. Now one of these will do. Uh, get the fibers. Safety first. All right, out I go. You're not getting my mitochondria, you creeps. Today. Hey, scabby. The sewage scabby. Uh.
back. now. Yeah, make sure I don't walk home through the haze. That would be... I'm going to say a tactical Armoring mistake up. is what we'll call that. Bombardier B. Oh. Tully. All coming together. It all makes sense now. Scabby nearby, apparently. Uh, under the tape. The sad stab. Hmm. That's one of the starting abilities of the Depression Rogue. It's a classic ability. Pink Stug, you will not harm me. I am faster than thou. Pink Stug. I have legs that are so fast past quickness. So what do we have so far from this supposed failed scientist? That is one big ant. Like, um, I'm considering like what he's actually managed to invent. First things first, we have like scalable production of spider web, which in and of itself is enormous. Uh, we have the muscle sprouts, muscle sprouts, which appear to be like. <laughs> literal muscle tissue that only requires like nutrients and water to grow in the most abstract sense. So probably could solve world hunger with those if he gave them to a company that wasn't interested in making them into gristle bits for their cereal. Hmm. Got the haze fungus and I don't know if that's really an achievement in anything so much as it is a war crime in everything. He's got the shrink machine, technically. That's still fucking amazing. Yeah, the shrink machine, as long as we don't shrink and unshrink people repeatedly. It's like, honestly, honestly, the fucking, even just shrinking something and then unshrinking it just the once would prove wonders for transportation. Yeah, no, like, uh, it, it doesn't seem like there's any of the, uh, the drift problems on inorganic things as well. Whoa! Okay. Uh, water gear back on there. Sort my inventory. I'm going to go give Burgle his chips, and then I will come back and do sort of end of stream inventory and all that stuff. I have two whole chips for Burgle this time. Quite proud. <laughs> Two entire chips. Nom, 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 nom. Do you think Burgle's chips taste good? Are we talking the British chip? Or are we talking you know. the, the American chip? Whichever. I think Burgle probably makes a good steak fry. Because I think the steak fry uh, sort of falls into the same purview as, like... Burger classification? Yeah. Yeah, no, like, anything that you can find at a steakhouse, I feel like a burgle should probably be able to produce. Uh, 
I see. Hey, Fed, get back here. Does that mean Burgle can grow broccoli? Do they have broccoli at steakhouses? Broccoli is one of the, broccoli is traditionally one of the very few vegetables served at steakhouses. Oh, I thought corn. Corn also. Well, I mean Burgle. Someone has to be growing those muscle sprouts down. So possibly? Hmm. Finish that sconce. Well, it's flavored. I love how they don't actually say what kind of soda Welp is, how just that it's a flavor drink. Up we go. A weevil's up. Virgo, my sweet boy! There may be a spider outside, but I have gifts for you. I, I tried so hard not to scream when I saw that spider. Ugh. Hello, my boy! Good morning! Good morning! How can I help you today? I've got another super chip. Thank you, Hoops. May I call you that? Yes, you may. Hand over the super chip and let us hope for the best. Yeah, the best! One more time. Processing! Processing! The Hayes Super Chip! Dr. Tully tried to deciphering the ageless properties of mushrooms. Disaster struck before he was able to the finish. The ageless properties of mushrooms. All of these great m memories are coming back! Well, well, well! Some good news! Ah, uh, attempting to unage yourself to mushrooms, huh? Now restored. Yeah. But not all of it, unfortunately. So he was literally trying to cure mortality rather than just not shrinking himself anymore. <laughs> Dude, no one's found the cure to immortality. And I have some strange memory just fragments stop. of a Guys, Java Matic. Don't worry Does about it. Does that mean anything to you? Strange memories of a Java Matic. Uh, my parents don't coffee. let me drink coffee. Coffee. Ah, that is it. It is Trudy's coffee maker. Though I cannot say I have any idea how this fits Are into the equation. Are we gonna use equation. it to make the embiggening cocktail? <laughs> However, I'm sorry, it's the last ingredient in mystery. the fucking embiggening cocktail not coffee. There is one more because Wendell likes coffee and needs coffee so much all the time. Please come again soon. Um... It might be that. Oh, advanced production buildings, hey! Wendell. Wendell. Spot oh. roast recipe. Heather A's cookbook. Fungaspacho. Well, it looks like, uh,. What was that noise you just made, bud? Hello there! Acting how can I he help made it, you he today? Made a fart noise. Ah, more chips! Here's a chip, bud. Then hand it over and let us see what I can remember. Pretty decent chunk of raw Much fun. better! Have an expo- I could really use some good g, g grilling right about now. Yeah? Me too, buddy. A beginning buddy. cocktail. A part of the rest, I think. Work, work, work. Oh boy. Berry leather, koi fish scale, gum nugget. Nah, uh, who knows? 
Uh, any upgrades in here? Oh, scabby scanner, milk molars, mint mace, mint mace. Deals um, fresh damage on hit, but useless for busting. I'm gonna get that, cause that sounds like an upgrade to my club that I have right now. And the splat burst, cause there's the yard ascent that I think I need a sticky bomb if I want to actually uh, pop open. Cause I don't trust it to not just roll down the hill on me. Ah. Uh. Slurp the core, comma, get yoked. Mint glob. Again, I need, I have need of a glob. Spider's still out there. Gonna head back to uh, the definitely not a palace. Then I uh, think we'll wrap up stream. You know, the palace list. Yeah, the palisade list. The Caillou Zone. It's where he was killed by a stink bug. Yeah. Shame he really shouldn't have just tried to huff all that formic acid. You know, he did just kind of walk up to the stink bug and be like, Hey, stink bug, give me all of your stink! And grabbed it by the face and, like, inhaled all of the stink out of the stink bug. Yeah, well, I don't know if you heard what he said to me before he did it, but he actually yelled, I'm going to inhale all of the stink! Then he did. And then he... yeah, but then he also immediately died. I mean, he didn't say he was going to live through inhaling the stink, he just said he was going to inhale the stink. What do you want? That, that, that poor stink bug was like a raisin after. He absorbed life essence in the process Can't somehow. Can't we sleep? Well, you know, clearly you've never been sniffed by Caillou before. That's a normal part of the experience. <laughs> I have never been sniffed by Caillou before, and I'm glad he is dead so I will never experience it. All right, well... Next time, I guess we have uh, some pretty clear goals in mind. Uh, the the black ant hill, uh, blasting open the the passage to the upper yard, um, finding out how to make a mint glob, which I think requires an oven, which requires going to the goddamn barbecue spill. Uh, barbecue spill. Ah, uh, the barbecue spill. Fun fact, uh, when they added the barbecue spill to the game, do you want to know what the running joke of the dev stream was? Yeah. Apparently the devs would occasionally just go, Oh no! Our grill! It's fallen over! In reference to that one <laughs> vine where it's just, Oh no, our table! It's broken! Uh... They just did that for the entire goddamn live stream. Well, I would too if I had just acquired a grill that had fallen over. Uh, do you have anything to say to the people before we conclude stream? The, the bird um, bath saga? Yeah, uh, don't drink the water out of a bird bath, even if you're very tiny. Yeah, it could have all sorts of diseases in it. Um, I'm going to send you now to a bird who doesn't have a bath. Glossy Ibis. Bye!